Belly? Belly, wait. I want to start with the three episode premiere, Lola, because there's a lot going on with Belly and Conrad in the first three. And the funeral scene is so pivotal in the books, and it's just as powerful on the show. What was the experience like of filming that and kind of navigating those like complicated emotions? And what kind of conversations did you have with Chris and or Jenny? What do you want? Let go of me. Yeah, I mean, it was something that I think we worked on for a while and talked about for a while because we knew how big of a moment it was. Being able to talk to Jenny was so important because I mean, you know, obviously Jenny wrote the books and had such a specific vision for the scene and she let us sort of, you know, trust our our instincts, which I really appreciate. And I think it was something that we really just had to prep for, whether it be doing script work or journaling or listening to music. And I think just being together on that day when we were filming, there was sort of a, a general, like heavier, different, tone than there had been before. So that sort of setting the mood sort of helped us all get into that scene and to really bring it to life in the right way. So you'll accept her help, but not mine? Got it. Glad to know where I fall in the ranking of ex-girlfriends. A lot of planning went into um, sort of crafting those moments, like from the funeral itself to the scenes after, because I know Jenny wanted it to be in a lot of ways really close to the books and she also rewrote it a few times to make it more brutal i'm impressed that jenny made it even more brutal <laughs> yeah thank you good i never want to see you again how difficult was it to get through that scene and that dialogue considering how like it punches you in the gut yeah it's it's tough i, I think the truth is we didn't even have to do it that much because it was just like the dialogue sort of does the work for you in a scene like that. What I enjoy doing in a scene like that is, as an actor, like playing against the dialogue as much as you can, because you don't need to reinforce these harsh words. When I heard Silver Springs start playing over it, I kind of lost it a little bit. <laughs> yeah, they Jenny really did it with the music moment there. <laughs> With regards to like the guitar playing, I worked with somebody for a while uh, trying to figure out like what that was. It's not a concert. He's like doing this for his mom, you know? He's not a singer. I mean, he plays guitar obviously better than Chris does, but I don't know. I wanted it to be sort of messy on all fronts. And one other thing in the premiere that really struck me is, and this was a change from the books, Belly loses her virginity to Conrad, which wasn't something that that happens in the books. How do you think that changes their story and their relationship in the show? Jenny wanted to portray that relationship in a way that would make sense uh, in, in 2023. And them having that moment was really, really special and was a visual way to show how connected they were in that moment and how magical and sort of like in their own world they were in the cousin's house. Yeah, I just think that it didn't change how much they loved each other from the book or anything, or, you know, how important their relationship was. I think it just made sense when Jenny was taking it from book to screen. <laughs> 